Hi everyone, my name is Howard Tucker. And I'm Joy Tucker, and together we lead the Welcome Center at New Life Church Saline. We absolutely love to serve. We have a wonderful team that serves along with us, and we just appreciate them so much. Hey, this is day three of our week of prayer and fasting, and we wanted to look at uh, the scripture for today, uh, John 17. Joy, would you read that? Sure. It's If you want to follow along with me, it's John 17, 24. Father, I desire that they also, whom you have given me, be with me where I am, so that they may see my glory, which you have given me. For you loved me before the foundation of the world. You know, here, uh, Jesus is interceding for his followers. It's his final prayer to the Father. His desire was to restore our original relationship with the Father. We were created uh, to have fellowship with the Father. Um, in verse one of that chapter, he lifted up his eyes and he, he was, it was moving. He was directing his prayer toward the father that we would be, uh, that we would see his glory, uh, that he had, he had shown while he walked on the earth. Um, but often we fall and fail at chasing after the glory of other things, of people. We give our attention and worship to the things of the world rather than to the author and creator of it all, God. God's heart is for us to know his love. Um, if you find yourself uh, far from the glory of, of the Lord and unable to uh, experience the last time that, that you felt the presence of the Lord, we set aside this week uh, just to focus on him and focus on his presence. Like Moses, Moses just simply prayed, please show me your glory, Lord. So let's just stop and reflect for this week and ask ourselves, am I living a life beholding his glory? Um, I know I don't many times. I get caught up in the busyness of my life, the problems that arise, um, just the difficulties that I don't just take time to just know that he's there with me through everything I go through, the good and the bad, um, that he never leaves me or forsakes me. And so I need to just stop and behold his glory. Well, we do that just simply by prayer. And uh, let's, let's pray. Would you join me? Heavenly Father, increase our desire for your presence and personal relationship with Jesus' love and glory. Lord, we pray for miracles of of God's glory to be clearly seen in our hardest struggles of life and health, finance, uh, mental health, and relationships. Lord, we pray for miraculous testimonies to go forth from NLC that would draw people who have never followed you to see you in your glory and your presence. Lord, we pray for the needs of those that join us today, and uh, we just pray that we would all see your glory. We ask it all in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Hey, thank you all for joining us today, and we just pray you have a wonderful week. We'll see you again Sunday. Uh, it'll be a time of communion and celebration, and we'll end the fast. So we just we just look forward to seeing y'all then. We love you. Bye. Love you.